What's going on guys? It's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and today I bring you the sexiest looking hunter on this planet. But before we get into the video, if you guys do enjoy it, do hit that like button. Let's try and reach 4,000 likes. That would be absolutely insane. Look at this bad boy. Look. Full iron law gear with the ornaments applied. Now, I'm not going to lie. It sort of got the best of me. I mean, I weren't initially going to purchase Radiant Treasure Box. I mean, obviously in the first week, I purchased, I think, about £10 worth. And I got a couple of other things needed to apply ornaments. But once I applied one, I just needed that shit to apply it to all my gear. And you just can't get it from um, one per week. It's just so rare to get them drop. And one Radiant Treasure a week from Bungie just isn't enough for me. You'll be going for months to try and get full ornamented gear under Iron Lord's gear. So I'm just going to show you guys it right now. I mean, I'm just in love with it. Absolutely. In Look at the cape as well. Even the cape's on fire. I mean, like, what? The days of Iron Crown. Let's have a close inspection of this. I mean, like, I ain't even bothered about this role here. I mean, like, I got intellect, so yeah, it ain't too bad. Um, the only problem here is worm spawn. I ain't got no worm spawn. Who goes to the dreadnought anymore? You need to be able to buy this shit. But look at that. Look at that, and I'll show you guys the best looking shader for this ornament gear without a shadow of that, especially the Iron Lord's gear. Um, without a shadow of a doubt, here the gauntlets now. I can deactivate these if I want to. I mean, like, that's what it looks like without it, but I mean, like, with it, it's just a whole different story. It's a whole different story. Chest, let's take a closer look. Oh, it's beautiful! Oh, it's beautiful. I've got the, the leg armor. <laughs> just amazing. Just amazing. I just want to know where all this gasoline comes to keep these fires going in this armor. To be honest, I want to know where that's coming from. And there's a the cloak. You can't really see the top of the cloak or the bottom of the cloak, but like if I spin it around here. It's a quite a sexual cloak, to be honest. Quite a sexual cloak. Now, I'll show you guys with a shader. Now, my favorite shader of that is Shadow Down. This is Sunset because. I mean, just look at look at that! <laughs> oh my, it's just so good. I'll show you a few more. Um, we've got here. What was that one? Uh, Stone Chalice. I mean, look, it, it all looks good. Everything looks good here. Amazing. Oh, look at that! Look at that! See that? Whoa, that's bright. That's my eyes. Damn. <laughs> I mean, like, I mean, none of it looks bad because it's fire. It just all looks so good. It just all looks so good. Look at my, definitely my favourite sunset without a shadow of a doubt. Now, if you guys are wondering how you actually get this armour, I mean, like, many of you should know already. But to get this armour, you need to basically complete. Uh, well, not complete, but do the challenges in your record book. Now, if this will load, I'll show you. I mean, I've still got quite a few to do, but I'm still a rank uh, 16. Now, once you get to a rank two, you'll get the arms, and this is for all three characters. This, this basically, if you do a challenge, you can do the challenges across all three characters, um, and they count towards the one record book. So, when you get to a rank two across all three of your characters, um, you'll get the arms, which will drop for all three of you. So, if I claim these now, um, I open that box, I will get three sets of gauntlets in that, one for the Titan, one for the Warlock and one for the Hunter. And saying once you reach a rank 4 you'll get the legs, ghost shell at a rank 6, then you'll get the, the chest piece at a rank 8, you'll get the head, the helmets at a rank 10, the emblem or title at a rank 12, you'll get the shotgun and winter's end at a rank 14, and then you'll get the class item at a rank 16. And then we'll, the ne well, next up, is, for me, it's uh, the shader. But I've got quite a few things that are quite easy to do, which I haven't done yet. I've still got to do 20 Seaver uh, Crisis Strikes. Um, the artifacts are just come every week. We've got 10 missions on hard I still haven't done. The patrol missions, so this, this, and this, I can all do this week. This, um, I'll just complete my form quest. I've I got the form quest. I can complete this now, and I'll get this done as well, which I could do this week as well. Um, Iron Lord Bounties, uh, probably another couple of weeks for that at least. Then we've got the Crucible, well actually, for the raid we've got uh, Seaver Charges Throne. 
almost done that. A couple more races this week, I'll get that done. I'm guessing these are probably for hard mode and challenge mode completions. Then we've got Dragon of Light, which is max ranking Iron Banner, which is coming next week, which I can't wait for. We've got the Trials Passage. This is easy. I mean, like, a lot of people complete a Trials Passage. This is basically pick up a Trials Passage, win, lose, or draw, whatever, complete that passage, and that's one done. Simple as that, and then you get five of them, you're done. And that is it, guys. My book will be completed. And to be honest, there's not much there for me to do. Uh, but yeah, that's how you get it, and that's how you get this sexual gear. Now, to actually apply the fire, I'll, I'll take off all the ornaments to show you what it looks like standard, if you haven't seen. Um, it's not that great, to be honest. It ain't bad. It isn't the worst looking armor in the game, but it's not that great. So I'll take all this off, and I'll show you guys exactly what it looks like. The cloak looks good. For damn sure. The cloak looks real good. Okay, so here we go. It loads up. Okay, it, 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 it looks sort of cheap. But it ain't too bad. I mean, I've seen much worse much worse armors. But the ornaments, they cost you um, two of the of these here. It costs two of them. And I think some silver as well. I'm not sure how much silver... I don't think I've got anything here which I can apply it to. Um, I don't know about red armor. Oh, no, I can't apply it to red armor for some reason. Now I've got nothing here so I can apply it to it to even let you guys know. You can't do it to the gold shot, can you? No, you can't apply anything to the gold shot. But yeah, I know it's definitely... It costs two of these and I think one silver. Could be five silver, but I think it's one silver. Uh, but yeah, these are real hard to get. These are the things that drop from Radiant Treasure Packages. And like I said, you need two for pe for each piece of armor. Yeah, you get one, if you're lucky, from a Radiant Treasure Box. So that's what I'm saying. That's why I just had to buy them. I just had to buy them. Bungie, Bungie dragged me in. I don't really need this. But yeah, Bungie dragged me in. But that's what you get from one thing from the book. You know what I said earlier. But yes, guys, that is the end of the video and the showcase of this absolutely sexy looking armor if you guys did enjoy the video do smash that like button i do appreciate the support make sure you subscribe if you want that daily destiny content turn on the notifications so you do not miss a single video of mine and i will catch you guys on that next one peace out until next time peace